Hi, yesterday we spoke about making a nice container of our rib cage, front, side, back rib cage, so that we become like a little Ganesh, like a jug of Ganesh. And inside that gut, jug of Ganesh hang our lungs, three dimensional lungs. So today we're going to talk about our lungs hanging in that strong container and breathing with our entire body. So we're going to start out with a block that you put between your knees. Okay, now if you don't have a block, a block is about three and a half, four inches. You can use something that's firm, a big one that you haven't used already. I'm going to do a Julia Child, throw it away. Um, we all have wipes, okay? A small box. A book. Okay. Um, conversely, you can use two pillows, okay? Just so that you can grip something firmly between your knees so that you have a sense of your legs. So that's why we're using the block and we're sitting on the edge of the chair, okay? So let me show you sideways. So without a block, it's easy to breathe and let the shoulders slump. With a block, you're activating the quads, you're activating this energy channel that comes from your hips up into your, behind your eyes and inner ear, okay? So without the block, it's easy to slump. So we're using the block. So squeeze the block between your knees. Look down at your feet, toes are long, pointed forward. You could even lift your toes and let them drop like soft flower petals and the skin behind the bones move back towards the heel. So you're aware of your feet. You're squeezing the block. Imagine the shin bone coming up towards your knees and the knees, an energy channel moving from the knees into the hip sockets. Hip sockets, a nice spark moving up towards the eye and inner ear. Pull back the knees. Okay, flatten the back. And inhale. Squeeze the block. Exhale. So it's as if you're in a container. This time the container is surrounds you like a big tube. And you can even think of the breath like water coming down to your feet on the inhale, and then water or air, whatever you like, rising up on the exhale, okay? So squeeze the block, find your feet. So feet, as much real estate as possible on the soles of the feet, so you can feel them. You can feel your shins, you can feel your knees. And when you squeeze the block, you have the sensation of the lower abs working, supporting the torso, letting the shoulders relax, okay? And you can bend your chin in slightly. Inhale, I'm aware of my body. Exhale, I'm aware of the body. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, nice, soft, gentle inhales. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And slowly open the eyes. Let's just lift our arms straight up. Inhale, squeeze the block. Exhale. Push the air down. Inhale, squeeze the block. Exhale. 
exhale. Feel your feet, feel your knees. Inhale. Turn the palms down. Exhale. So there's slight resistance when you're moving the hands down. Inhale, you're slicing up, moving the navel and the sternum back slightly. Exhale. As if you're in salt water, moving your arms down. Again, sternum navel back slightly, squeeze the upper back, inhale. Palms turn down, exhale. Hands on the knees, softly inhale, exhale. And just be aware of the entire body. Going back to our lesson, the lungs hanging within the container of the rib and the breath moving through the entire body. We'll do that one more time. Squeeze the block, widen the feet, navel slightly back, sternum slightly back, flatten the upper back, relax the shoulders, relax the jaws. Drop the chin slightly, close the eyes, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, and one more time, inhale, exhale, and slowly open your eyes. You can practice this on your own. It's good to just, it, it brings your focus to just breathing and just your body, not all the other things that are going on in the world right now. Just being with your body, with your breath, inhaling and exhaling. Using the block today between the knees to be, bring awareness to the legs and the feet. Again, sitting on the edge of the chair, not back in the chair, and flattening the back. Okay, that's it.